and thus a united... Dr. Henry Jeffrey, the former PVP Member of Parliament, says that Guyana is not unique in the challenges that it has with regard to the ethnic divide which results in the way Guyanese vote. A few other countries have had to face this difficulty and have had to establish consensual government arrangements in which no side can dominate the other. And there are also other means to protect ethnic interests. Dr. Jeffrey was speaking his bi-weekly podcast, which is a feature of the A New and United Guyana Agnew Party. The veteran educator said that Guyana is ripe for some construct of a shared or inclusive governance structure. The proposal here also allows for an equitable proportion of women and young people to be involved in the day-to-day -day management of the state. It also effectively destroys the power of the presidency and permanently establishes a small and less costly government. However, comprehensive constitutional reform will have to come to allow for post-election coalition to make it simpler for independent persons to become members of parliament, to strengthen the separations of power, to establish recallable, directly elected member of parliament, and a law for greater regional and local autonomy. The former educator has constructed a diagram to explain how the new government structure should be established, and he explained how it should function. The orange and oval section is the presidency consisting of five ministers who will form the cabinet and will rotate annually as the president. The two parties gaining the highest vote at the general election will each nominate two ministers and the other could be elected by a third party. My choice is that the fifth minister be nominated by civil society. Jeffrey says that there should be an equitable amount of young and female representatives and that several ministerial portfolios should be merged to significantly reduce the size of government. Henry Jeffrey concluded his summation by noting that his suggestion would see that no political party would ever again dominate the administrative landscape of Guyana, which would usher in a united public opinion. No political party can dominate the other or ethnic constituent blame the other so a united public opinion can develop. For Channel 2 Headline News, Wendell Jeffrey.